Getting back to breaking news out of Hampton this midday, the search for a missing toddler has come to a heartbreaking end. We just heard from Hampton Police Chief Terry Salt at the top of the hour. He says they found remains of a child believed to be two-year-old Noah Tomlin. Let's get right to 10 on your side's Kayla Gaskins. Kayla, it's been a very tough day for the community. It has been a tough day for the community and what police chief Terry Salt said earlier in his press conference. It's been a tough 10 days for the community. That's how long they've been searching for missing toddler Noah Tomlin. And this morning at about 850, he says they believe they found remains that could belong to the missing child. The body was found at the steam plant. The police chief said that the scene is still being processed. They wouldn't release any details on the condition of the body or the nature of how it was found. The chief did say that they have spent more than 10,000 man hours on this search. They've also searched for 2 million pounds of garbage and they were able to isolate the trash from the area of interest, but that's still 2 million pounds of trash. That is a lot for these officers to go through. And he did say the last 10 days have been very tough, both because of the searching conditions. It is hot and it is humid and they are searching through trash and there is gases, but also the nature of the task. And that's something that he really did want to hammer home today. This is what they spent the last 10 days doing. This is what his officers have spent the last days focusing on. He said some of his police officers have had Noah's picture in their car so that they know they know what they're doing and today they accomplished that goal, although it is with heavy hearts that they were able to bring closure to Noah's family and closure to the Hampton community. I'll have reports on this tonight with coverage starting at four. For now, reporting live in Hampton, I'm Kayla Gaskins, 10 on your side.